Hi, this is Marcy with Earth Sky. About an hour before sunrise on the mornings of February 22nd and 23rd, you can spot the waning crescent moon in the morning sky. On the morning of February 22nd, the moon will float near a distinctive pattern of stars called the teapot. It might be difficult to spot before dawn, but once you spot it, it's easy to see it as an earthly teapot. The teapot is an obvious pattern of stars in the constellation of Sagittarius the Archer. Then on the morning of February 23rd, the moon floats among the stars of the teapot. You can spot them about an hour before dawn. If you look about an hour before sunrise on the mornings of February 24th and 25th, you'll see the moon closer to the horizon with the teapot nearby. And a fun thing to look for on those mornings is earthshine. It's a delicate glow on the unlit portion of the moon, its light reflecting off the earth. You'll need a fairly dark sky to see the teapot. It'll rise earlier each day and be visible in the evening sky by the June solstice. In a dark sky, you can imagine clouds of steam rising from the teapot spout, but it's really the light from the stars in our Milky Way galaxy. From Earth, we gaze toward the center of the Milky Way galaxy located between the tail of Scorpius and the teapot of Sagittarius. Our Milky Way galaxy is a spiral galaxy and contains hundreds of billions of stars. We're about two-thirds of the way out from the center in one of the Milky Way's spiral arms.